Hey you guys, it's Peter and Boo Radley and Pee Pee's behind us. Are you here? He says, I'm here, just leave me alone. If you wanna hear my prophecies and my predic predictions, I guess I'll do them, but leave me alone then. Gotta get on the red eye to go to Texas tomorrow. I got a line dancing competition to participate in that, come on. Okay, we'll make this quick. Anyway, if you guys have been watching my videos for a while, you know that Boo Radley, okay, is a psychic dog. A lot of people don't know that, but some people do. So I took to Twitter and to Instagram because so many people, like literally hundreds, have asked me to hear about Boo Radley's predictions. What do you think about Boo, that Boo Radley? He goes, I mean, I am a pretty good psychic. Of course, everybody would ask me about my predictions. Well, how much do you charge? He goes, I charge a lot of money. He goes, I charge, I don't know, $500, maybe. I would maybe do it just for a bone if somebody was nice enough to just give me a bone, but nobody ever gives me a bone. <laughs> you ready to do your prophecies and predictions for 2017? I guess if they really want to hear them, I'll tell them my prophecies. I don't really care. <laughs> Who's your favorite psychic of all time? I mean, Sylvia Brown, of course, she's a genius. <laughs> he loves that Sylvia Brown. Did you like that Long Island medium? He goes, I don't like that Teresa Caputo. Her hair's foolish and she got long nails. All right, let's just get right into this, Boo Radley. So, the first question that I was asked by Andrea Brown on Twitter, for you, Boo Radley, for me, yes, for you. All right, I guess I'll answer the question if I must. The first question is, is this the year Taylor Swift will find, tr find love? <laughs> oh, no, let me think about it for a second. Come on now, Boo Radley, let's think about it. Tr Taylor Swift, he goes, yeah, I know that girl. <laughs> Do you like her? I mean, I met her a couple times, she's a little skinny. <laughs> Do you think that she's gonna find true love this year? I think she'll find true love this year. Well, who do you think she's going to start dating? Who will it be? I don't know. Probably somebody back in that one direction again. I think I, I think she'll be get back together with that Harry Styles. All right. You heard it here first. Boo Radley said she's going to get back together with Harry Styles. Maybe He just likes to be called Styles now. Do you know that? I know. I don't really care for him so much. <laughs> okay. Oh, John Wilson. He asked us. He wants to know whether or I will actually cave in and get Botox. What do you think about that, Boo Radley? He goes, I don't care about that, John Wilson. He thinks he's a drama channel. He's not. <laughs> do you like the drama channels, Boo Radley? He goes, I, don't, I mean, I don't know. I like that pimple lady more. <laughs> you like the pimple lady? He goes, yeah, I like that Dr. Pimple lady. She's kind of funny. She makes me laugh. Who else do you like? I like that Glows All Green. She's got it going on. She's real funny. Do you like Trisha Paytas? I don't like that girl. She thinks she's kind of, she thinks she's got it all going on. She's not that funny. You don't like Trisha Paytas? I mean, she doesn't have a dog, does she? You like Shane Dawson? I like Shane Dawson. He all right. He's not very funny. He eats too much crazy food. You don't like Shane Dawson? I mean, he's okay. I don't really care, I guess. <laughs> Boo Radley, what will you be doing in Texas? I'm getting me. I don't know. I think I might. Why are you asking me all these stupid questions? I think I might. Get me some cowboy boots. I want to do boot scooting buggy and I want to do a line dancing and I, I think maybe ride a horse or a llama. You can ride a llama. I mean, if I want to, I will. Don't worry about it. I'm pretty independent. <laughs> okay. John Wilson wants to know, do you see? In this year, whether or not he will actually cave in and get Botox. He said, let me think about it. I got to consult my psychic feelings for a second. He goes, all right. <laughs> you want to whisper it to me? He goes, oh, I can just say it. I don't need to whisper it. Well, that, lay, that Lay's Mills or whatever that uh, athletic stuff is, it isn't really working for you. So you might want to think about doing something extra. I don't know. you got some wrinkly foreheads up there. <laughs> Bradley. He goes, I'm just saying. I mean, AJ ain't looking so good for you these days. But Bradley, that's not very nice to say about people. He goes, well, I look pretty good. <laughs> You're not worried about anybody else? He goes, I mean, I don't really care. I like that Lisa Vanderpump, but she's okay, I guess. <laughs> Why do you like her? Jiggy. <laughs> you better get jiggy with it. Let's see what other other questions are. Oh, Boo Radley, look, who is the next biggest big celebrity divorce? I don't care about all that stuff. Those people are idiots. Well, who do you think it is, Boo Radley? You got like one long hair hanging off of you. He goes, I don't care. Leave it there. I kind of like it. It's kind of like my beard. Boo Radley, who's the next big celebrity divorce do you think that will happen? Uh, I think it'll be that Ben Affleck and that Jennifer Garner, but I really do kind of like them. He was pretty good in some of those movies. What movie was your favorite? I like that movie Force of Nature. <laughs> they're living in, or they're staying in the Walmart overnight when it's raining real hard. I like that movie a lot. I like the Walmart. You do? 
I mean, if I have to go somewhere, I guess I'll go to the Walmart. It's kind of fun. <laughs> You're wearing me out with all these questions. I am? Yeah, why are you asking me all these stupid questions? <laughs> I got a plane to catch. I got Because I think maybe now I'll go to Hawaii. You're going to go to Hawaii? I mean, if I want to, I will. Well, where will you live, Lou Radley, if you go to Hawaii? I live in a tree like St. <laughs> like Swiss Family Robinson. Don't worry about it. What will you eat? I'll maybe eat a pineapple if I want. I'll go snorkel and see a sea urchin. <laughs> Boo Radley. This is Boo Radley when he was on the front of the LA Times for being called Boo Radley. Little unknown fact. Oh my god, we got 25 questions. Oh my lord, I'm never gonna make my plane. I only fly first class. How do you fly first class? I mean, I got a lot of money. You have a lot of money? How do you have a lot of money? I don't know, I bought stock and bones that went up. <laughs> All right, boo, first question. By Clue Esteen. How long is Trump gonna be president? Oh Lord, I'm so tired of hitting this question. Well, what's the one thing that you like about Donald Trump? Mm, I don't know, we kind of got the same hair, I guess. <laughs> Do you like Donald Trump? I, mean, I liked him on that TV show. He was pretty good on that apprentice, didn't you think? I like that TV show, but he's our president now, Boo Radley. That don't mean nothing to me. I don't really care about all that stuff. Just let me be. I just want to go to Hawaii or Texas. <laughs> in, in 2017, Boo Radley, will you finally become YouTube famous? <laughs> I don't really care about all that kind of stuff. It's my dad and PP that care about that kind of stuff. That's foolish to me. Well, what do you want to be? Rich is where it's at. <laughs> Why rich? I mean, when you're rich, you can do everything you want to do. You can travel all over the world. I might want to go to Seattle and see some bands. <laughs> you do? Okay. Is PP going to be more YouTube famous than Peter if he gets an own channel? Why do you keep on asking me all these stupid questions about being YouTube famous? I don't care about that stuff. I told you. Well, who do you like on YouTube? He goes, I told you I like that Dr. Pimple lady. I think she's real funny. I like that Glozell Green. You do? She's real funny. She makes me laugh. I just get laughing so hard. Can you see me? I'm laughing on the inside. <laughs> is pp oh wait will you will i get the okay this is from green bean studios that's about the stupidest instagram name i've ever heard <laughs> pp or boo radley will i get the job i've been wanting and get my own house i don't even know why you'd care it's better if not to have your own house i live with my dad's and three other two other dogs it's just easier that way just get just go and move in with somebody it's cheaper and it's easier boo radley i know but i'm just saying it's easier i always got my place on the bed <laughs> okay pj a chorus asks will aliens make first public contact will you make a music video to end all music videos oh you were gonna sing there for a second weren't you bud I don't know why people always want to know about the aliens. See, this is the thing about the aliens. I'll tell you the truth about the aliens if you want to know. The aliens are already here. They are? I mean, you can see them everywhere. They're all over the internet. They're in the drama channels. You can see them. They're always they're just the craziest people in the whole world you've ever wanted to see. They're aliens? He goes, I mean, are you stupid? You look all around you. You see aliens. He goes, they're everywhere. You can see them. Oh, ghosts, spirits, aliens. I can see everything. You can? Quit asking me all these stupid questions. I told you I got a plane to catch. <laughs> Get away. <laughs> okay, let's see. Just a couple more questions. How long we got? Oh, not much longer. Oh, Nicole wants to know, will Neil and I get married this year? Girl, why are you asking me such stupid questions? Why don't you ask him to get you a ring first? Well, how, what kind of ring? I don't know. She's kind of a pretty girl. I guess she deserves something big. A couple carrots. <laughs> Do you think she should get a diamond? No, I think she wants a ruby. You do? I like Ruby Tuesday carry out. <laughs> He's fading fast. Okay, will you ever come out of hiding to the satisfaction of Scout and Jim? Oh, He says, I don't know who them people are. Who are Scout and Jim? <laughs> he goes, I don't read. My B's and O's are real still bad. He goes, I got held back several years in school. He goes, my brother Pee Pee says smart though. All right, can Boo Radley continue to tell us his vacation plans? I so love that. I would also like Boo to tell us the most shocking news of 2017, something that will shock us all. It says, Ms. Sardi. You want to talk about your vacation plans? 
I mean, I guess if I must. So here's my plans. I'm planning on flying into Dallas. I got me some good friends there. We're gonna hang out. We're gonna go to the, we're gonna go to uh, Ryan's buffet, and we're gonna just eat up like we haven't in days. And then I'm gonna go back there. I'm gonna take a nap. And then I'll get me some custom made, custom made. I said custom made cowboy boots. And then we're gonna go out and we're gonna go line dancing. You are? I mean, come on. I love that Tammy Wynette. You do? He says I love her so much. I hope she's there. I hope I get to meet her. Well, maybe you need to go to Nashville instead. Well, why? Because that's where all the country music stars are, Boo Radley. He goes, I'm kind of tired. I'm kind of over all this prediction stuff. It don't matter anyway. What will happen will happen. Do you want to tell me the most exciting thing that will happen in 2017? <laughs> Boo Radley. Boo Radley, did you fall asleep, honey? He goes, I'm real over this now, Dad. <laughs> he said, I, you, you've zapped my psychic abilities. <laughs> Tell me the most exciting thing that will happen in 2017. He said, you know what the most exciting thing that's going to happen in 2017 is? You and Daddy, <laughs> Pee Pee and Tucker will finally move away and let me sleep and live alone in this house of crazies. <laughs> he said, I'm so tired of it. Can't I just be my own person and be independent? You want to thank the people? Who are the people? Those people right there in the camera, do you see them? I don't know none of them people. They better just leave me alone. <laughs> you want them to leave you alone? I want them to leave me alone. They're not nobody. Well, there you heard it. Straight from the horse's mouth. Or from Pooh Radley's mouth. <laughs> He's so shy. I'm not shy. I just don't like to talk about my prophecies unless people are paying me. They are paying you. We're monetizing this video. We are. How much is my cut? Well, we'll have to see how much this video does. If it gets a lot of likes, we make a lot of money. Well, I guess then you'll get a little bit of something. Well, all right, I guess if that's the best you can do. We'll be back later. We love you guys. Bye.